Bodion maintains that officials of the Federal Capital Territory Administration called the council to come and get a refund of their money, barely 48 hours to the date for the rally. According to him, officials of the Federal Capital Territory Administration insisted on the PDP getting their refund as they are acting on orders from above. As we are aware, yesterday, the 8th of February, the Buhari Presidency and the All Progressive Congress controlled federal government viciously denied the people's candidate, Al Haji Atiku Abubakar, the use of the already approved venue for our scheduled presidential campaign mega rallies earlier bills for today in the federal capital, Abuja. Money was paid to the federal capital territory administration. And from the account provided to us in the campaign, they paid and they were informed that an official of government will go and an official of the uh, 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 department will go and open the venue for them to cite. And they were directed to the official. When they got to the official, he declared that there's a counter instruction. What was the counter instruction? There was no answer. And they went back to the department where they paid the money, only to be told that there's an order from above. They tried to make up and said that we should look for, they will find other facilities. But the People's Democratic Party, Nigerians that are rallying with us, and the people's candidate will not be driven into a shabby arrangement.